So Sven Stoik there from Belgium actually had to have a groom down in obstacle number one. His time was 87.91. But uh, you won't be surprised to learn that in fact there are penalties, quite a few penalties that you can pick up when things do go wrong. So uh, when a groom actually dismounts in an obstacle, he's completely off the carriage then that can actually count 20 penalties. And if you think that one penalty equals five seconds, then 20 penalties is a lot of penalties uh, that can severely restrict you through the rest of the marathon course. So bad luck there for Sven Stoik having to have a groom down in obstacle number one. And the two grey ponies and the two bay ponies. 55.28 then, 55.28 to Yandelur through obstacle number 7. And just flex the fastest time again, so... Um, just uh, 0.5 of a second, half a second past the Yanis Kins. So the overnight leader, Yan de Boer in fine form, holding five of the seven obstacles he's so far driven with the fastest time. He will pursue obstacle number two. And you from the obstacle judges, in fact, uh, Yandabur had one knockdown. 